when my talks are going to start? Yeah. Start at man start. Man start. Yeah. Okay, that's good news then. Is he going in the right direction? Yeah. He's going to have him. Yeah. 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 Is that the only fight you want right now? Yeah. You're, you're, go. you're very, you go. fairly confident that it does happen. Nothing like gets in the way of the negotiation. Man, 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 man. <laughs> <laughs> I have two companies, you know, that reach out to me that, you know, wanted to give me and Spence $25 million guaranteed. $25 million guaranteed up front. So, a real guy like myself, I call Spence. Hey, bro, look, listen, you know what I mean? I got this company that's willing to give us 25 million a piece, guaranteed. What's up, what you gonna do? He like 25 million, what about the back end? I'm like, dude, listen, if they make their money back, then we get 80, 20. You know what I mean? It's simple math. I said, man, we got people all buying the buying. I mean, still in the fight. <clears throat> they got the fire sticks. He laughed. He like, man, I got a fire stick too. I'm like, see. I'm like, man, ain't nobody really buying. You know what I mean? Paper views no more. I said, man, we, we get this upfront money and we good. It's a no brainer. You know what I mean? But one thing about me and the, well, the different. I would say the difference between me and the difference between Spence is I'm really my own boss now and he's not. He got to go through Al. He got to go through, you know what I mean, his team and ask them if he can do certain things that I don't have to no more. Yeah, I'm a, I might have had to when I was with Top Rank because I was signed to Top Rank and they was my promotional company. So of course I had to go to top rank and ask them to get me this fight or do this for me or do that for me because I was obligated to do certain things by their standard because I was signed to them. But now that I'm a free agent and I'm free to do whatever I want, I'm the one sitting at the table. I'm the one that's, that's you know, talking directly to these, these high individuals. Errol Spence not talking to you know what I mean, Terrence Crawford about the fight. You know what I mean, Errol, Errol Spence wasn't at the table. Errol Spence can't tell you or show you a contract that, you know what I mean, says Terrence Crawford, Errol Spence, you know, that he was there on the negotiations of. He can't do it, you know? So he had to go back and ask Al for permission, you know, if he can, you know, take this, big chunk of lump sum of money to fight Terrence Crawford, which he didn't call me back. So I proposed it to Al. I hit up Al. I'm like, Al, listen, you know, man, I got this big hedge fund company out here. You know, they, they claim they know you. Not one, but two. Not one, but two. You know what I mean? Two companies willing to put... 20 plus million in both of our pocket guarantee. I'll tell me straight up, I'm not letting nobody touch this fight. I'm like, all right, cool. But I'm like, why? He like, why would you want to put a ceiling on you, on yourself? Why you want to put a cap on yourself? I'm like, well, that's not putting a cap on myself if this company is taking a risk. And you know, risk, high risk, you know what I mean? High reward if, if that's the case. You know, I can't seem to see a fight that's been doing millions, you know, since Floyd and them. So, you know, that that was an altercation.